In this video, we will explore the optics module of SIMFI, and will make basic simulations using various optical tools. Select the optics module from the menu bar, and you will notice a series of tools in the drop-down toolbar. This section of the toolbar contains various kinds of surfaces, such as plane mirror, ideal lens, ideal mirror, plane refracting surface, arc mirror, and arbitrary refracting surface. This section of the toolbar contains sources of light, such as white light, parallel beam, and point source. Let's create the first simulation using a plane mirror. Note, to create an object, follow the instructions on the information bar. Click to select the first point, and then the second point. You can also move the above two points as per requirement. You can continue to create the mirror, or exit the tool by pressing escape key or, by clicking arrow button at the bottom. Also, from geometry module, select measure angle tool to show the angle between the two mirrors. Now draw a point source over the mirrors as shown, and notice the images are projected behind the mirror. Now hide the axis, using axis settings, by unchecking draw axis box. Then change the number of rays for our point source from the properties table. Move the mirror and notice the changing number of images as well. You can disable the visibility of the point source as shown, so as to calculate the number of images using the angle between the mirror. Let's create another simulation using spherical mirror. First select the ideal mirror tool and draw it over the canvas. Take the first point at the origin and the second point anywhere on the y-axis. Now hide the axis, using axis settings, by unchecking draw axis box. In this way, we can apply constraints on the convex mirror to be editable only along y-axis. Now add a slider from the Add Widgets tab and assign its name to focus of the mirror in the Properties table. Click on the slider and change its maximum and minimum value as 5 and minus 5 respectively. Interact with the slider and notice that the mirror changes into concave mirror. Now from the Geometry module, select the Free Point tool and create a point as desired. Select the Parallel Line tool and use it to draw a line parallel to x-axis and passing from the previous point. Now create a point source from the Optics module, choosing its first two points on the same line and third one on the pole of the mirror. Mark the image formed by the mirror as a point from the Geometry module again. Now we need to create an object and image using image from two points. Since the tool requires two points to work, we need to create the second point for both, object and image, using the projection point tool. Now create object and image using the image from two points tool, which is to be filled by a PNG image. We're going to drop the image from a files window to the SIMFI. Now insert the PNG image into object and image from the properties table as shown. Also, use flip X or Y checkbox to invert the images if needed. Change the position of the object and observe how it affects the image's position. In the similar manner, we can create another simulation using lens. Let's create another simulation using multiple lenses. First create two lenses side by side on x-axis. Project parallel beam on the first lens obliquely. Upon adjusting the lenses, you will see two images from the two lenses. Add an observer using the observer tool. If you keep the observer between the two lenses, then he will see a real image and if the observer is beyond the second lens, then he will see a virtual but magnified image. This is the working principle of microscope. Hope you got an idea of basics of the optics module.